2024 presidential candidate Chris Christie making a South Florida stop. And he spoke at a town hall event in South Miami. Local 10 News reporter Leanne Morejon live with the key issues Christie discussed today. Leanne. You know, Christie is only polling at about one or two percent among other Republican presidential hopefuls. And it's not lost on him that the two front runners are Florida men. And that's exactly where he found himself today. He spoke to a crowd here of voters that are open to alternatives from former President Donald Trump. And by and large, they seemed impressed with his remarks. Former New Jersey Governor Chris Christie at Casa Cuba restaurant in South Miami. And I want to thank all of you for being here this morning. Dozens gathered for the town hall event happening just days before he will debate other Virginia's. Republican presidential hopefuls vying for the party's nomination. We got to be willing to take on the beast of government spending. And I want to set up educational freedom accounts in this country. We will clean up the crime in these cities. Former President Trump and Governor DeSantis have talked about wanting to end birth rate citizenship. What is your position on that? I, I wouldn't end that. If we fix the immigration system, in a way that's logical, we wouldn't be having this argument. Christie, one of the few GOP candidates calling out the front runner, former President Donald Trump, over his claims of a stolen election and his four indictments. It was a lie on election night, it was a lie on January 6th, and it's a lie today. Christie also taking jabs at Florida governor and fellow candidate Ron DeSantis, including this one about the governor's actions against Disney. The best way, I think, for government to be involved in this is not to be. It's let consumers make these decisions. People we spoke with said they were impressed with Christie. I, I wasn't leaning towards anybody, but now I'm leaning towards Chris Christie. He is very direct speaking. I think Chris Christie maybe is someone who can win. Even some Democrats with open minds. I'm registered as a Democrat, but I believe I'm going to leave soon. Um, I like the things I heard today. I think he attracts both independents, Democrats, and Republicans because he cares about the entire U.S. And I'm told by my colleague Glenna Milberg that uh, former Governor Chris Christie has just arrived to Versailles Cuban Cafe, where we're told that he will be uh, eating, speaking with potential voters there. So much more to Chris Christie's visit to South Florida. Stay tuned to Local 10 News for updates. For now, reporting live here in South Miami, Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News. Leanne, thank you.